And I know I'm looking like Richard Petty. Obviously, I'm not. But Peter, like Peter, have you approved the car? Uh, it's got a thumbs up. To me. It's got a thumbs up. Uh, Peter went and had his car done over at Mako. They did it for a very economical price, and he is pleased. So Peter's pleased. So I'm pleased. And here we go. Looking at Peter's car. Peter's. Your son's name is uh, Brian. Brian. Sorry, Brian. Looking at Brian's car, a.k.a. Peter, here she is, and what's the color? Pepper Gray Metallic. Pepper Gray Metallic. Sounds like it's for a Bentley or something, that color. Look at Gene Pose. And look at, look at, look at. All right, here we go. Let's take a look. And there she is. Dun, dun, dun. This, you, this car was yellow, wasn't it? I, I've, already, like I've already forgotten the color. It was beige, beige. And there it is in her gray. There's those pipes sticking out that we put on. And uh, there she is, guys. Going back to the, the uh, corral, as Bobby calls it. The corral. Oh, and, it's the uh, stable. The stable? The corral is low end. We're yeah. the stable. Oh, the stable now? We're the stable masters? We've always been the stable. All right, she's coming back to the stable masters. Uh, we are going to uh, do the whole interior. We're going to remove the front and back glass, do the headliner, uh, put it back on. We're keeping, the, I, think, I believe we're keeping all the same glass. Uh, I think we're looking at a grill, bumpers door handles, the whole nine yards, we're looking at it, and uh, you're going to get to see her come. There's Joel, the man in the myth. Three and a half years ago, I met this man, and he kept telling me, block and sand, block and sand. So, <laughs> so here it is. Uh, she's been painted, and she's going back. Gentlemen, start your engines. <laughs> we, still, we got a little belt going, but she's a beast. She's a beast. She's going back home. All right, we are following um, the car home. Blinker's working, brake test is good. I know, I gotta put my seatbelt on, but I wanted to catch a quick video for you guys. And basically, I'm, I'm tailing Bobby just to to, re, uh, to make sure nobody's texting and runs into the back end of them because we don't need that. So we're gonna get her home and uh, keep her safe. But she's she's running excellent. Started up after a month of the work that they did, and then they did an extra week after we inspected it to clean it up even more, and she started right up again. So going back to Mustang Man. Part of what we do, guys, is we, you can get it painted elsewhere. I mean, we're working on our spray booth, but what we do right now at this moment, before we have the spray booth, which is going to happen, mark my words, is we kind of police the project a little bit and just keep an eye on it and make sure that uh, if someone else is painting it, you know, uh, Peter chose to go uh, with Mako. He spoke to Joel, he felt comfortable. They did do two stage on it. They didn't do single stage. And uh, he spent some more money than a typical Mako paint job. So what we did was we visited with him and we looked at it and gave our comments and you know coached him through the process of approving a car. And we can do that for you. Um, we're gonna be painting a number of cars uh, that are gonna be heading out um, in the next couple of months at local places. Uh, but we are going to have our own spray booth and our own paint man and body man at Mustang Medic in 2015, mark my words. Mark my words. We've got to take it all inside. But we'll utilize everything we have now. And there is good work to be found out there. It's rare, but it's out there. 